We're turning back the clock now to a time when even we were very young. I know, in, I know in my case that's really hard to believe, but there was a time when I was young. Um, <laughs> this weekend marks a milestone birthday for a former Motown star called Jimmy Hamilton, who made his life in Chorley. Sarah Rogers has a very intriguing story for us. Pennsylvania, USA. Please put your hands together for Mr. James Jimmy Hamilton. Good God about it. The fascinating life of Jimmy Hamilton caught on a Granada documentary that's more than 40 years old. If the Lord made anything better than this, he must have kept it for himself. <laughs> Born in Philadelphia, he worked security for Martin Luther King in the 60s before he was shot by a drugs gang. I wound up in the hospital. You know what I'm saying? My left eye, partially blind, you know. In the 70s, he took to the road with group The Realistics. It meant everything to me because uh, I started it. What's happening? And tomorrow, he'll celebrate his 80th birthday in Chorley. <laughs> his family have joined him from across the pond for the occasion. Hi, Daddy. It's a big difference from Philly, from Philadelphia. But I love it over here, you know. I've been over here now over 40 years. One of his daughters uncovered the old footage looking for clips of the group performing for his birthday party. I can't even, I don't have any words. It's, it's so bizarre to see my dad so far, you know, back, yeah, back in the 70s. It, it's surreal. I just think he's just so smooth and laid back. I love him to death. <laughs> I love him, and I love how he performs. He really just enjoys. From Philadelphia to world tours, what is it about Chorley that made you settle here? Uh, actually, it was the beer. And once you drink two pints of that, you can't move. You're hooked. That's You're right. Chorley, and that's the end of it. Now that's deep. If you live in the Chorley area, you might just be familiar with Jimmy. My dad was a taxi driver um, in Chorley. He used to play all his hits in the cars, all in the 1990s. And uh, yeah, and he's he, yeah, very well known. In fact, he knew my husband before, he, before I knew my husband. <laughs> We had really good times. That was amazing. Amazing. Happy birthday to you. Now retired as the singing cabbie, it was time for Jimmy to be serenaded by his family. Sarah Rogers, ITV News in Chorley. Happy yeah, birthday, what Jimmy. Story. What a great story. I've got jumpsuit envy now. <laughs> now, let's get the latest weather forecast. Here's Joe.